So I think that's why they've cracked onto exciting times. All right. Green light on. No more bets. Here's race eight at Gawler. The Bunyip Stake. Favourite box two. Exciting time. Set to go. Away in racing, even line, no exciting times, closer to last and first. Good speed, recklessness, burns across and finds the front. Five grands, three lengths away, trying to chase it down behind those profiteers. And exciting times, who's six lengths from the leader. Can't catch it, though. Behind those was Sassy's leader out the back, Black Sombrero and Yoda. But a good beginning by recklessness, and recklessness is going to be too good. Uh, photo second, five grand, but Profitess really lunged late and made it interesting. Exciting times was fourth. Then in turn behind those, we had Sassy Zalina, Black Sombrera and Yoda together at the tail end of the field. It's a good run around 22.70. Good jump. Recklessness. Kennel mate to exciting times has pounced on the lead from out wide. She began well and uh, she has... Clearly done her best ever start here at Gawler, but in fairness to her, it's only a second try over the 400. But she jumped really well, found the front, gave nothing else a chance. 8.64 was the early split, 22.70 approximately. So standing by for the official time and the numbers to come through as well. Now, Prophet, Prophetess, Prophetess lunged late. On the outside, it always looked like Five Grand was going to run second. But Prophetess has surged really late on the line and made it interesting for second prize. And does get up for second. So six beats one and five. Six, one, five. And 22.75 was the time. The run home was 14.